12 hours after Guy's arrival at the station, his 24 carriage train finally pulls into Delhi Junction, with no explanation given for the five hour delay. She's going to be cosy on here, isn't it? That's a lot of people, boy. Better late than never. Bloody massive, eh? Massive. It will make a 10 minute stop. Do we pull the bike on or do they put it on? Shove it up there, I think. Panicking that after the huge weight, his bike will get left behind, and with no sign of a porter, Guy sets off to find the luggage car by himself. He gets to the end of the platform only to learn the luggage car is at the opposite end. Is it? The train will depart in five minutes. He finds the right car, but there's a rush of unloading taking place first. All right, mate. Get her on, mate. There are now four minutes left before departure, but Guy is told to wait. Can we get it on, mate? Yeah? Finally, yeah. he gets a chance to load the bike, All right. only to lose his place in the queue to someone who'd arrived at the station just moments ago. Two minutes to go, a guy gets his chance to try and load the bike. Just drop that camera. And gives out, gives a lift. There's barely any room left. She's cozy in there. But he gets rammed in. Okay. And he finds his sleeper carriage. S7. Just in time. In, the, in here. There's a seven hour journey ahead, and conditions on board are less than hospitable. The man's got a gun. The ticket collector's got a gun. Don't mess with the ticket collector. We had a mate, we had a rolling rat down there earlier. Really. Yeah, it reminds me a bit of um, Scunny Nick. I was locked up in Scunny Nick once. This smells a bit fruitier <laughs> with the loose here. I ain't got the best sense of smell, but I can smell that. So if I can smell it, she must be fruity. Until morning, if his beloved bike has made it in one piece.